Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. In this video, we're comparing two cartridges. The 350 Legend and the 450 Bushmaster. Got a whole bunch of water jugs lined up. We're gonna take aim and see if we can catch these bullets. I'm pretty confident we can. See how many jugs it takes to stop the 350 Legend and the 450 Bushmaster. And we're gonna see what the bullet looks like expanded Assuming we catch it, I'm sure we will, and see how many jugs it takes to stop it. But let's get to going, see if I can catch this 450 Bushmaster first. But let me give you a real quick look at these up close before we get to going. There is the 450 Bushmaster that we have out here today. It's Federal's non typical whitetail, and these 450 Bushmasters are 300 grains. The 350 Legend that we have out here, exact same ammo but it's a 180 grain projectile. There's that 350 Legend. Let's see what we can do. I'm gonna go pick up the 450 first, see what happens. All right, I changed my mind. I'm shooting that 350 Legend first. So here's that 350 Legend I got loaded up. I'm gonna be shooting this out of a CMMG MK4, chambered in 350 Legend. Sweet, sweet shooter. I absolutely love this AR and 350 Legend. But let's take a shot here at these jugs, see if we can catch this. Hopefully we can catch it and we don't have to shoot again, but let's hope I can shoot straight here. Right down the center of those water jugs. I think that might have been a good shot. Let's go check it out and see what happened. So, I can tell you right now, I'm impressed just by how many jugs are left on the table. So, we had six up there. Wait, no, we had seven up there. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. And there's six, seven on the ground. Yeah, I thought we only had six, but we had seven up there. Good thing I double checked that, or we would have been wrong, but. Here's what happened. Look at that. Yowzers, guys. One, boom, completely gone. Two, boom, completely gone. Three, same thing. Look at that damage. Phew. Number four, our shot is still dead center there on jug number four. Jug number five, look at that entry hole, guys. We couldn't have been any more dead on than that. So there's jug number five. Is there a hole in the back? There is a hole in the back. Back here to jug number six. There's water coming out the front. And there's water coming out the back. You guys, you gotta be kidding me. Holy mackerel, I did not expect that. Jug number seven, baby, please tell me you caught this bullet. Nope. Came out the back. Completely came out the back. So. I think there's your answer right there as far as 350 legend penetration. We did not catch the bullet. That went completely through seven jugs of water. I did not expect that at all. I have caught a whole lot of centerfire rifle bullets and I did not expect that. But that's that federal non-typical whitetail 350 legend ammo went completely through seven jugs of water. All right, now I'm gonna shoot that 450 Bushmaster round. This is a Ruger American Ranch. We'll see what happens to those jugs. Wow, tell you what, that shot a lot more water back in my face. You guys could probably see it coming back at this camera, but looks like a straight shot. So if we go, 
Let's go see if we caught that bullet. All right, so walking up to it, remember again, we had seven jugs. There's one on the ground there, one on the ground there, and one that's completely missing. So as far as initial shock, 450 wins. But then we have four left on the table. First three gone, four left on the table. Fourth jug, entry hole, exit hole. Fifth jug, entry hole. Possibly an exit hole, but not sure because the sixth jug has nothing on the front of it. So, sounds like and looks like there's a bullet in here. Let's see if we can find it. And this red one here is the fifth jug. Let's see if we can pour a bullet out of here. I sure hope we can. And there is that 450 Bushmaster round. You can see there's definitely lead that came off of it, but lots of power in both of those rounds. Pretty wild there, guys. The 350 Legend went completely through seven milk jugs of water. That's pretty wild. You guys saw all the footage. Massive devastation from the 350 Legend. Then, 450 Bushmaster, hey, we did catch it in the fifth jug, but same story. Real good penetration, real good devastation. Don't forget to check out my friends at the Heavy Metal channel. Go check them out and subscribe if you haven't already. Don't forget to subscribe to the Hootie Hoo channel if you haven't already. We'll see you on the next one. Hootie Hoo! Oh.